What's up, everybody? I was just going to do a little Amazon tool haul. Some cheap stuff I picked up off Amazon. You know, sometimes it's so cheap, you figure you're going to, you know, get ripped off. And sometimes you do, sometimes you don't. I've never heard of a lot of these brands. Take this for instance. Well, this was a fairly cheap set. And it's missing a lot. There's a lot of skips. I've got the half inch out right now. But, yeah, not the best. It's skipping a lot. It goes from 18 to 21, so you got to, you know, use a three-quarter... another one same company this is uh, another one that was larger sized sockets and uh, it skips some sizes too a lot actually so you always want to try and get no skip sets they're just easier so yeah both of them big time skip sets kind of a bummer they look okay. I've hit. I. I. Um. I don't know. They look all right. They were pretty cheap. Uh, this was pretty cheap too. This was just a, a little compression tester for cars and small engines. And it was super cheap. It was like thirteen bucks or something. Haven't used it yet, but I, I'm going to be soon. Sun X, this was like 60 something bucks. It's a half inch drive impact set, or I mean, quarter, I'm sorry, quarter inch drive, which come in nice, come in handy. They're nice for tight spots. There's sometimes you can't get a full size socket in there, and these little ones will fit. Here's a good example of it. The way these are recessed down in these fins. I don't know if you can pick it up on camera, but you need a shallow socket for these. The big fat one will fit down in there. Not shallow, but thin. Shallow is not the right word, a thin socket. Uh, this half inch drive torque wrench. I wanted one that went over 250 pounds or 200 pounds. And this was pretty much the only one I could find. And it's beefy, it's sweet, it's real nice. For friggin' loving this thing. I'll do more in depth stuff. And then this an Amazon ball joint kit. Ball joint press kit. I was a little skeptical, but I was like, you know what, fuck it. The power built one's like almost 300 bucks. This thing is super surprisingly beefy and good looking. I mean, this thing is super hefty. So, I'm happy with it. I haven't used it. I haven't used it. I just got it. It's got the Honda, special Honda adapters. Those are nice. A lot of sets don't come with those and they're expensive on their own. And you could do U-joints with this, which I plan on doing a video with that. Yeah, Amazon ball joint press. But yeah, that's my little tool haul. I'll do some more in-depth stuff. Thanks for watching.